Hello everyone. Um, I'm gonna start this video off with going to ask you about. So it would be I would really appreciate it if you could hit that subscribe button, hit the like, and hit the notification bell. Today we'll be talking about my dog Lenny. She is a wiener dog that was sick for about two weeks now. It was difficult to hold her in because she was, she she had no control of how much she was, she was using, she, how much she was using the number two outside or inside. She had no control over that. It all started when we were, uh, we don't know how, what happened that she got sick all of a sudden, but we think it's medication that we're giving her because she has heartworms. And uh, so she got sick, very sick. And because in the beginning she started having diarrhea, a lot of diarrhea. <clears throat> in like 15 minutes she had a, four or five pounds of diarrhea already out of her. And <clears throat> It was difficult because she had no control. She was just going at it. She was just using the number two all over. Then she comes back inside, and then it comes to nighttime. My parents ask her, ask me to take my dog, take Lenny outside. I take her outside my, because my my mom, my she notices that Lenny had was vomiting everywhere. She was vomiting a lot. I take her outside. I notice that she still had vomit in her mouth. She vomits outside. Then she starts wobbling with her one of her legs open like this. Like she's walking with one of her legs like this. She's wobbling, wobbling. She's walking up to a tree that has a hill. It has a little hill, a tiny hill. It's, it just goes from hill up, it goes like, and then tree, you know? She f walks up to it, and then all of a sudden she just falls, she falls. She's paralyzed on the, on the, on the sidewalk, she's just paralyzed there. She just, she doesn't, she's not doing anything. She's a, she has the vomit in her mouth, she's walking, she's going like this. With her arm, or with her little leg shaking like this. I have I run after I run to her to pick her up. She picks I pick her up. She starts vomiting. She starts vomiting everywhere. I take her back inside. My my parents. I tell my parents what happened, and then my parents say, "We'll just go back outside I, for a little bit more, for like a few minutes." And then I I agree with it. I go outside with Lenny, my dog. Take her out. I notice. She still has vomit in her mouth. She has, she still has to do number two, everything. She She's just sick, completely sick. She vomits, uses number two. We walk around the court, and then we come back inside. And that's it for the night. We, we rest with her, we put her in her blanket, put her in her bed, and then she goes to sleep. My mom comes back outside, comes back from her room, and then she, because she wants to check on the dog, Lenny. She then checks that Lenny was still sleeping. The dog. She was still sleeping. My mom, my mom loved it because usually at that time she start, she would use, she would start pooping everywhere. My mom then gives her coconut water. She wakes up Lenny and she ma and she tells her to drink the water, to drink the coconut water. She drinks it. All of a sudden in the morning, she's not even in the, she's not even in her cage. She's not. But she's actually under the table that she and she's eating uh, a bone that we give her to make her breath smell good. It's a, it's a type of breath mint that's really tasty for the dog. And it's also good for us because it makes her breath smell good. She then starts eating. Me and my mom wake up because me and my mom 
wake up and our eyes are just open. We're just, our eyes are just wide open. We're like, cause she hasn't eaten. She's been eating so little and almost nothing all week for two weeks. And all of a sudden, she's eating a lot now. She's eating the amount she ate before she was sick. Then, now, because uh, before she was sick, my parents would fool around and start playing with her by acting like she, they would grab the piece of meat that she, we would give her or the food that we would give her. Then they would start acting, and then she would start growling and start barking, and then run after them, run after the meat, piece of meat, grab it, run into the cage. Comes at, comes back out and starts launching, starts, starts biting and biting. It's, not, it's like missing bites and bite biting my parents' hands. But when she was sick, my parents acting like she was never gonna get the piece of meat or the food that we give her and she wouldn't move. She would just start going She would barely even she would barely even growl. She wouldn't even bark. She was just there. Going, then she would just go back to sleep because she couldn't she didn't have the power to run after it. She didn't act and she lost her appetite so she didn't genuinely she didn't really need it. She needed it, but she just didn't want it. She then became sick. We gave her coconut water, and she felt all better. She's eating now. She's perfectly healthy. She eats. She's doing what she usually did before she got sick. And then, and now she's normally normally going to the bathroom. Normally going outside with me when I take her out outside and now she's she starts running around the court with me on her leash with her on a leash one time I lost the leash I literally lost the leash like the leash came out of my hand because she ran so fast she started you know, ran around the entire court by herself three top three times three times running around the court. I had the, I was so close to getting the leash, I started running after her. Because of her little legs, because of my wiener dog's little legs, she they don't run very fast. Like, not fast. So I started running after her. I catch up to her. She starts speeding up. She wasn't even using full power. She was just, it was like a warm up. She was just, and then she started speeding up. She started going, yum, yum. Me, on the other hand, I'm like, what? She was sick last night. Now she's all, how come she's all better now? I started running after her. I started speeding up as well. She wasn't using full power yet. She was still doing a warm up. She started speeding up more. She started going, it was first a going, yum. Second, it was going, you, 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 you. Third, it was going. <laughs> I run up to her. I grab the leash. Finally, I grab the leash. And then I have a hold of her. She stops running. Then we go to the middle of the court in order to get to the apartment that we live in. And, and then she, she's all happy. But you know when the dog, when a dog is thirsty or like, because they ran a lot or they played around a lot they start going like <laughs> yeah and then we had the water there she drank a lot she drank almost all of the water we had to give her another and we had to give her another bowl of water because of how much she drank and we were just surprised because one night before she could barely move. She could honestly barely even move. She couldn't even, she barely growled either. And now she's really like a psychopath. She's eating. It's just, it's just a blessing, you know? Okay, guys, I'm gonna end the video here. Just to let you know, it's just a reminder. 
just like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you can have more videos like this of an explanation of a dog or explanation of anything and gaming videos. See you on the other side. Goodbye.